Here we're looking at our new Smart Coat. This is a new urethane coating uh, that Sculpt Nouveau has developed. Uh, it comes in a spray bottle like this. You can spray it out of a, a regular plastic bottle with a little sprayer. Uh, it comes in an aerosol. And you can spray it out of a spray gun, such as this uh, HVLP. Once you put it on, you've got to let it dry for at least two hours before you put your second coat. Full curing takes about two to three days. This is our new Smart Stain. It's a stain combined with our Smart Coat. So, yeah, that means you're getting protection and you're getting a transparent stain at the same time. It has zero VOCs. Um, takes about anywhere from an hour, depending on the humidity or the weather, hot or cold, to about two hours to dry. Uh, curing time is about, oh, anywhere from three to ten hours. This is our new urethane epoxy coating. It's a two-part. It has a catalyst and a body. Um, so you have, a, it's a one-fourth catalyst to three-fourth body. Um, it has to be mixed very thoroughly. Um, it has about a 12-hour pot life. If you were to put it in the refrigerator, you might be able to get uh, 10 or 20 hours out of it and it can be either brushed, it brushes very smoothly. Uh, you could do it through a small uh, spray um, airbrush unit. You, you would have to have a glass airbrush unit because it's a solvent. So if you were using a plastic, you might dissolve the plastic. So it has to be glass. You can do it through a touch-up gun like this or through an HVLP. On coatings of it, you should let the first coating dry for at least 30 minutes before you put the second coating on. Uh, drying time, or to where you can touch it, is about an hour. Um, full curing is nine days. So it, it actually is hard within an hour, but for full curing to where it is very, very hard, you really can't scratch it. It's uh, wonderful for like bar tops or things where you I have a lot of abrasion and you want something that's going to hold up, uh, this would work really well for it.